Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you my bug out bag, or B.O.B. <clears throat> so here we go. And <clears throat> uh, first of all, I would have a tent and a sleeping bag in addition to this. Um, you know, they're all in the same place, so if I did need to bug out, I'd grab the tent and sleeping bag as well. First of all, there's this uh, shovel. And um, but what it does, if you squeeze right here, it's also a, um, you can use that like a pickaxe probably. I don't know, like this side. I'm not sure if that's just there, but you, I guess you could. And then this side, you can use as a hoe, you know, in like a garden. It's kind of... And then, Okay, now on to the bag itself. As you can see, this is a, a soccer backpack, MLS, Adidas. Um, but I don't play soccer anymore, so I have this. Just this bag, just um, for this. In the front pocket right here, this is designed to um, hold a soccer ball. Like I said, I don't play anymore, so it's open. In it, I have a first aid kit. And a crank flashlight. Um, a crank flashlight with two settings. Well, those are two different settings. I don't know if you can tell. A siren, a cell phone charger, and a radio. So that's a really cool device, really handy. In this pocket, there are just two bottles of water. In this pocket, there's a small hand shovel, a sewing kit, a flashlight, an uh, another flashlight, a compass, and I believe that's all. Yeah, that is. Now, um, we'll move inside the bag. We have some binoculars. These are also my, um, my bird watching binoculars, so I have them on top, just so if I decide to go bird watching, I can take them right out. They're, um, Bushnell, I guess it says right there, I'm, or Stanley, I don't know, I'm not, like, really into binoculars, but, so I've got those. My survival kit, I have a, um, another video on that. Check it out. A um, emergency space blanket. And this is a fleece, really warm fleece blanket. Um, I plan to replace this with wool as soon as I can get my hands on a wool blanket. So, okay. Now I have this um, box container, and this is just filled with miscellaneous items, so I'll go ahead and show you that. A little um, survival whistle, compass, mirror, ferrocene rod, and waterproof match container with a lanyard. A magnifying glass for uh, concentrating sunlight to make fires. Some fishing line, a glow stick, some toiletries like toothbrush, toothpaste, comb, a poncho. This is a large plastic bag. This is actually a comic book container, but I had an extra one. So I put that in there. You could use it to carry water. Uh, a regular Ziploc bag. A box of strike anywhere matches. A some rope around a carabiner. Uh, another carabiner and some hand sanitizer. Some dryer lint that um yeah catches sparks really well. A small little button compass. Let's 
see what this is in here. Oh, this is just the instruction manual to my compass and a fishing kit with um, hooks and bobbers, a bobber, some sinkers and some lures. I'll go ahead and put the um, line in there. Okay, next we have a full canteen of water. Extra socks and underwear. A hat. Some bandanas. A roll of duct tape and a roll of uh, kite string. A ski mask. Let me. With the eyes and mouth hole. A um, old dishcloth. Um, a, a slingshot that you can, um, you know, go hunting with. This isn't the one I prefer. I just, um, because actually the one I prefer I use, so I didn't want to put it in here. But this is, um, newer, so this is pretty much brand new. So, I've got a slingshot. And I have a note, notepad and pen. And last... And outdoor survival guide so thank you for watching go ahead and comment tell me what you think and thanks